Hey, hey, YouTube. It's your old buddy Dave with Alabama Floats. Been a minute since I've been on the river or water. Well, been a minute since I've been fishing. Um, took a couple weekends to chase some ducks. Opening day and the following weekend. Didn't have much luck and uh, figured out I'm not really good at video and hunting just yet. That's going to take some more, some more camera gear. But anyway, first day of this week, it's not really raining. Um, 50 something degrees, high 60. I was wanting to come out and fish these laydowns, try to catch some crappie, but uh, got out here in the water really high from all this rain, obviously. But you know, we're here. I'm gonna give it a shot and see what happens. Stick around. something finally finally got somebody what is it the bluegill what we got what we got yeah look at you oh you a nice one too oh that's a nice size little bluegill here you buddy look at you all purple huh it's interesting all right, man. We appreciate you either way. Thanks, buddy. What in the world? That little baby bass. Look at that. I hear you, man. You didn't have any trouble getting that thing in your mouth, did you? Oh, gone. They gonna swallow it, son. Not what I was aiming for, but I ain't gonna be mad about it. Oh. You absolutely swallowed that thing. All right. A little baby bass. We'll take it. Thanks, buddy. All right. Splash to everybody. All right, y'all. We, uh... It's catching, but it ain't catching crappie. I feel like a crappie ain't gonna hit it. And all I'm going to catch is panfish and baby bass. I could probably do better with the beetle span. That's what I'm going to do. Oh, there's another. There's another little fella. <laughs> Woo! They're getting smaller, y'all. That gum. Going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong direction on the table. What's going on in your head, man? Like somebody tried to eat you. Get that hook out of your mouth, bud. Come on. There we go. Woo! Little, little, little fella. Goodness gracious. Still appreciate you, buddy. Still appreciate you. Wow. What did I hook into this time? He's in the tree. Come on, buddy. Stay out of that tree. Stay out of that tree, man. Come on. Uh. What is that? A little bass. I hear you. Look at that. Look at that, y'all. Did not expect him on a crappie jig. I changed colors, wasn't getting any bites. I kind of gave up. Turned the camera off. Look what happened. Truth is, my batteries are all about dead. I'm trying to run my GoPro off the battery bank, and that ain't working out too good. 
I was trying to save all the battery that I could. There we go. Hey, we'll take you, little fella. Appreciate you. It's a good time on a four pound line. Mighty good time. There it is. There it is. All morning we've been looking for the crappie. Ah, <laughs> finally. It's a third or fourth color jig. Oh, hang on, buddy. He ain't keeper, but he's pretty. Look at that. Good looking fish. All right. <laughs> Mission accomplished. Thanks, bud. All right, YouTube. That makes largemouth, white bass, bluegill, crappie, and skipjack, which I didn't get on camera. We'll count it for now. We're going to try to catch another one. Five species. Pretty cool. Let's keep fishing. What's going on? Not much. What's happening? Same old, same old. Holy cow. Right in front of the boat, dude. <laughs> that is a keeper crappie. Wow. You got to be kidding me. Holy cow. That's nuts. Oh, oh, oh. All right, you two. Well, yeah, that's not a keeper. Probably not. Anyway, good looking crappie. Right in front of the boat. Go figure. Thanks, buddy. All right. Black and blue body with chartreuse curly tail. Second crappie of the day. Who'd have thunk it? I don't think I see them as much. Yeah, I don't. There he is. There he is. Another one. Look at that. Get in here, buddy. Get in here. Woo, that's a nice one. Yeah, you're right. That is white. On that curly tail grub, son. What I'm talking about. <laughs> All right, let's see. I got my El Cheapo Leatherman has uh oh man i thought that thing had inches on it don't go i think an old construction guy would have a tape measure see if my scale no my scale's got no tape measure oh it's my other leatherman that had the inches on the back all right so that's Two and a half, five, seven and a half, nine. That's nine inches, baby. Sweet. That's a keeper. All right, you two. Got some crappie nuggets ready to go. A little stove heated up, a little skillet. Brought me some oil. I had it last week for some duck breast. That's why my skillet's so small. We're going to have to do two batches of crappie, but that's all right. We'll let you know how it turns out. Southern Paddler's got a little fire to boot. Not too bad. First crappie in the skillet. We're going to do it fancy with olive oil because that's all I brought. Won't be no fried fish today, y'all. Just sauteed. All right, YouTube. Here you go, crappie in a cup. Brought a pan to fry it in. Didn't think to bring plates. Not sure I got any, actually. I don't have camping plates, but we're gonna test it out. Southern Paddlers tried it. What do you think, man? It's good stuff. Pretty tasty? Man, yeah. Nice All right. and fresh. 
Here we go. First campfire crappie. Sauteed in olive oil. Because that's all I brought. Let's hope it ain't too hot. Not too hot. Not bad. I think I got one bone in there, but it ain't terrible. Yeah, a little extra I, calcium. Got a little uh, scale in <laughs> bite. Yeah. Cleaning fish on the rock was a little challenging, but made it work. Not bad for a last minute Saturday trip. All right, YouTube. It only took Southern Paddler three hours to get a fire going. <laughs> In his defense, everything is soaking wet. It's drenched. Because it had been raining for a solid week. You said we got, what, two inches one night? In one night, yeah. One night so we, we got two inches of rain. Probably over three for the week. Yeah, it's it's been a really wet week. Like I said earlier, the creek is pretty much flooded. So it is what it is. But, hey, we had a little fish dinner. Sitting by the fire, listening to the birds. Not a bad Saturday. 